Right now on House Dad Life, we are going to take and we're going to swap this puppy out and this puppy is going to go in its place. Let's open up the box and see what we have inside. Pretty fancy little box. There's the new thermostat. Very nice. Here's one of the little uh, sensors it comes with. And let's see what else is in here. We got instructions. First thing it tells me, read it without even looking. Download the app to get started. So we'll have to check that out. Oh, now this is cool. Uh, I was kind of reading about this yesterday. If you only have a four wire thermostat, it tells you how to set this thing up so that you can use the five wire install for this thing. So that's, I thought it was an additional accessory that you had to buy, but it came in the box. So that's pretty cool. I do not need it on mine. I do have a fifth wire. A little stand for the sensor. Got our back plate and uh, some screws. And that's all that's in here. That's fantastic. It looks really nice and easy. I'm gonna take and just pop the sleeve open and see what we got in here. Oh, this is always nice when they include the, uh, the wire labels. I was wondering how I was gonna be uh, doing that. So I'll definitely be using those. Back plate, I'm sure this is optional. And a little how to install handbook. Looks pretty straightforward. I'll set the camera up and uh, try to give you guys a good angle. We'll throw the time lapse on and see if you guys can uh, learn something from my mistakes. All right, before I start anything, first things first, let's make sure the power is off so that we're not gonna get anything zapped or short out anything nice and fancy. For me, That'll do the trick. The uh, furnace in my house uh, has the DC transform in it that powers the thermostat, so that'll do it. That'll shut off the power. In typical man fashion, I won't uh, read any instructions. I'm just gonna grab and start to disassemble. So let's see how that goes for me. All right, I got the old wires here. Got everything exposed. I'm just going to take and label these things up and uh, then I'm going to yank them out. Two, three, four, five, six wires. Interesting. Thought I had five. All right, to pop these wires out, you just push down the clip and uh, you can yank them out the back. I will straighten them out and label them up. That was a Y1. I will try my best to put these on in a way that they will stay. Anybody else wonder why they always just make these things so tiny? I mean, it fits, but considering there's three wires in an electrical box, and there's six in here, a lot more real estate in an electrical box. All right, 
Should all be uh, connected up. Wires are in. I'll take the uh, unit. Make sure I have it the right way. Nothing to it. Let's power it up and see what happens. That'll do it. A little tab to remove here. All right, so right now I'm just taking and downloading the app on my smartphone. And as soon as I've got that installed, I'll follow the instructions and uh, just keep going through it. All right, app installed. Let's see what it's doing next. There we go. She's all set up. Okay, so before I install this thing, I did a little, little bit of YouTube video watching to see uh, how easy this would be. And judging from the Nest install, people were saying it took a little bit more effort to put this one in. I'm finding the opposite, honestly. I put this thing together, put the wires on. You guys seen me do the install and the setup. I have not told that I had a two-stage furnace. I guess the AC makes sense because it's on the Y wire. But, uh, yeah, I'm not sure how it figured that out. Pretty cool. All right, let's uh, take now and add the uh, sensor. So, try that. Sensor. Smart sensor. Pull the tab. So what it tells me to do. Tough to do holding the camera. Cool little stand. Almost for location. That's easy. And just like that, it's on my app right away. So how was this thing to install? A uh, piece of cake. Incredibly easy. Uh, stage heating, no extra effort, nothing. Apps user friendly. Uh, couldn't have been more easy to install this thing. Don't hesitate if that's uh, what you're thinking about. Had a great time putting the thing in. Had it up and running in about 15-20 uh, minutes uh, total time. There's almost no time lapse at all in the video for you guys. So it's pretty much a real time install. Enjoy. Enjoy.